from the race. You saw this first on CBS News Boston. For the first time ever, the Boston Marathon is excluding a group of runners. Anyone now living in Russia is out. The BAA says it's taking this stand to support Ukraine after one runner's impassioned appeal. He spoke to Christina Rex, who is at the finish line tonight. As Maxim Siegel tapers his Boston Marathon training runs, his passion for his birth country of Ukraine only grows. I'll be wearing um, my heart on my sleeve, literally, because I'll be wearing sleeves with Ukraine on them. A representation of war-torn Ukraine in a sea of runners from around the world. But two countries will not be represented, Russia and Belarus. We need you to make a statement. You need to become, go public with this. Siegel was one qualified runner who pressured the Boston Athletic Association to exclude Russian and Belarusian residents from the big race. On Wednesday, the BAA announced it would, saying, like so many around the world, we are horrified and outraged by what we've seen and learned from the reporting in Ukraine. We believe that running is a global sport, and as such, we must do what we can to show our support to the people of Ukraine. That decision made Maxim wear his marathon shirt with pride. These are the colors of the BAA. These are the colors of Ukraine. I'm a proud Ukrainian American. I'm a proud Bostonian. I'm very proud of the BAA for taking this stance and for hearing us. And to anyone now disqualified from the race, Maxim says Belarusians and Russian people can stand beside us in solidarity and say that, you know what, I'll skip this year. You know, it's not worth it uh, to be representing my country at this time because of what's happening um, to the Ukrainian people.